Hey guys, welcome to SourceFed. I'm Joe Beretta. I'm Trisha Hershberger. Amazon CEO Jeff Bezos stunned the staff of 60 Minutes this weekend when he dropped a bomb when he revealed the future of Amazon delivery. Dropped a bomb is an interesting phrase to turn, Joe, because the CEO disclosed that your future delivery man very well could be a drone. Yep, in the form of an octocopter with the capability of ferrying to you your package one half hour after you submit your order online. This is... This is how you do that. The service, which Amazon says won't be up and flying for at least four to five years, has been dubbed Amazon Prime Air. Which coincidentally is also the name of the antagonist in the upcoming Transformers 4, the fall of blah 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 boom boom Mark Wahlberg. As of now, this fleet of octocopters retains the ability to fly a payload of up to five pounds, ten miles in any direction from Amazon Fulfillment Center. Fulfillment Center. Fulfillment Center. Sounds like a future sex thing from an 80s movie about a dystopian future society. Amazon, you stole that from an 80s movie about a dystopian future society, didn't you? So your ability to utilize this new service depends on if you exist within 10 miles of a fulfillment center. That and the FAA, which Amazon is eagerly awaiting to alter some standards and policies so they'll be able to offer the unmanned drone service, which I hope happens, because if safe, how awesome would it be to immediately receive airdrops of Sour Patch Kids in bulk and Bath and Body Works scented candles? Scented candles are great. Your house can smell like anything. So in the next four to five years, Amazon will be working on making sure these things don't crash on unsuspecting families playing in yards. On some sort of security measures to combat what I think will be the obvious creation of an intricate street gang that focuses solely on tracking and stealing from the drones. On how to keep kids from knocking them out of the sky with their darn sports balls and shoot guns. On how to massage the FAA into granting them permission. And pushing back against the government who will obviously want to put mini government surveillance cameras on all the drones. See? 80s movie about a future dystopian society. Also, just so you know, Amazon isn't the first to attempt this as SF Express in China has been dabbling in the drone delivery testing for months. Better so. get on it, Amazon. Yeah. So, do you guys think we'll see the service in the near future? Would you use it? What's your favorite dystopian future book or movie? Mine are Brave New World, The Giver, and V for Vendetta. I was gonna say The Giver. It's good. You it. took mine, I love it. Giver's good. Discuss The Giver down below. After you guys are done, please click the annotation for our five stories of the day. My name's Joe Beretta. I'm Trisha Hershberger. Have a wonderful day. Yeah, and don't forget to like and subscribe and all that good stuff. If you want.